Well, I'm Scott Sullivan Bell coming to you live from Oahu. It is April 27th, 2015, and we're talking about the new sale at 8.28 in the morning. And I want to give you a phrase, set it and forget it, right? Set it and forget it. Set it and forget it works good for cooking food, but it doesn't work good for sales. That means that you're gonna have to follow up before, during, and after the sale. And I know that you're saying, hey, Scott, I've heard this before. You know what, this really isn't the new sale. And I'm gonna somewhat agree with you, but this is a good reminder for you that you need to, to talk to the person about what's going on. You need to talk to them during the sale process and everything, if you're doing an install, or you're delivering something, and you need to talk to them after the sale because there's this thing called the internet, right? And the internet is, is the deity that controls everything about the information that you have. And what happens is if people go through and they buy your product, your service, your widget, your gizmo, or whatever you have to offer, they leave reviews online. And there's like this website that is a four letter word. And it is a pain for people and, and people love to go there and complain. And look, get it taken care of before that complaint happens online on that four letter word website. And I was about to tell you which one it was, but you know what it is, kind of rhymes with help. And so what happens is if you're not taking care of issues as it's live and as it's going on, then you're gonna have some problems. So like today, if I have an issue, it's not so bad. Tomorrow it gets a little bit bigger. The day after that, it gets a little bit bigger. The week after that, it's huge. And something that could have gotten dealt with right here, and like when it was really small, would have cost you a couple of dollars. So the longer something takes, the more it's like a compounding interest. So if it was a dollar today, $2 here, $4 here, $8 here, $16 here, $32 here, that's the type of problems that you have. That's why you have to deal with things before the sale, during the sale, and after the sale to make sure that everything was delivered properly. Is it more work? Yeah, it is. But you know what? Most people don't take the time to do that. They would rather just deal with something on the back end and give somebody a pile of money. Now, here's the thing that you have to understand. What's highly valuable to you is referrals, a referral, is, a referral is way more valuable to you than a cold lead. So why not do everything you can to get those referrals? So if you think about like the cost of getting someone out to a, a sales call, depending upon the industry, is between $250 and $5,000, right? So you're like, yeah, but it doesn't really cost that much. Yeah, it does. By the time that you figure out marketing and overhead and expenses, it's between $250 and $500 bucks per lead, $5,000 per lead, depending upon the industry, depending upon the service. And that's pretty expensive. Do you know what it costs to get a referral? Good service. Do something that's gonna get you good service. Check in before, during, and after the sale and make sure that everything's good. And then check in after, after the sale later on. And people are like, well, I don't give referrals. Look, it's your job to ask for them, but it does make it easier for you to make more sales, okay? So your job is to follow up before, during, and after the sale. Before is like when you're there selling it. During is during the delivery or where they're getting it. And after is to make sure that they're happy with it. And you know what? If they're, if they're willing to get something in writing, cool, but video is way better. If you have 500 testimonials on video, oh my goodness, you're way better than the guy who has one testimonial in writing because that person sees other people. I, I could be anybody you want. I could be Bob Smith from Ohio at this point. Bob Smith from Ohio says, Scott Sullivan Bell is the coolest thing ever. He's got the best training. He's the smartest guy. He's dope. He's awesome. Whatever word you want to use for awesome or fantastic, right? Cool. So videos are way better because then that person's real. And if you could do it in the setting of where they're at, that makes it even better. And some people don't want to do that. That's okay. But if you ask 10 people, chances are good. You're going to get six or seven of them to do it. So follow up before, during, and after the sale. That's part of the new sale because then that keeps you away from having problems on social media about you know, your product, your service, your widget, or gizmo. Now, if you could do a small favor for me in the box down below, you have a comment, question, or story, that'd be fantastic. To the right or to the left, there's a subscribe button. Subscribe and then send it out to all your friends via StumbleUpon, Facebook, Twitter, Google+, Scott Sullivan Bell. Only Scott Bell is still See you soon. Thanks for watching. Aloha.